Hey, Tequila here. Welcome back to Southern Twang, my YouTube channel. Today what I have for you is a Salvation Army thrift haul. And I'm just going to jump right into it. The first thing I have here is a sweater. And it has fringe at the bottom. It's really cute. It's by Clue. Now when I looked up Clue, I saw that there was a Clue by Willoughby and that was an anthology um, item. So I'm not sure if this is the same Clue they're sold at, and I did I say anthology? I meant anthropology. <laughs> okay, anyway, so let me show you what the shirt looks like. It's that little piece at the bottom there that is it just makes it unique and different and more feminine than just a regular sweatshirt. Next up, I have a, a blouse. It is a almost 100% um, ah, silk. 100% silk blouse. It's by Theory. And I think it's this lovely, lovely, lovely color here. So it has the pleating in the front and this long keyhole in the, the front as well. But this shirt, I'm not sure whether or not I'm going to keep or sell. I haven't tried it on, so if it doesn't fit, it's definitely going to be a sell. And that will make my decision easier. But I think this is very cute. The Salvation Army, I have to say, did not disappoint this time. Normally, I go in there very, very um, rarely because they hardly have anything good in, in our local Salvation Army. So next up, I have a plus-size piece by New Directions, which is sold in Belks. This top is very cute, and this mustard, golden mustard color is, is this is my color for the summer. I have a dress. I got from Old Navy that looks pretty similar to this except for it's a long sleeve dress but this shirt it's normally let's see $52 it still has tags on it and it was marked down for $25.99 I don't know if you can see that but it's new with tags can't beat that Okay, next up, I have this shirt that is, it's called Tresix, that's the brand, but it's just your average, run-of-the-mill, slinky, not slinky, but lightweight shirt, but I like them down at the bottom that the hem is asymmetrical and that the, the sleeves here are kind of rolled, kind of cuffed up. So it's very lightweight for the summer, but it's very on trend right now, for me at least. Anyway, so I definitely will be keeping that. And here I found this lovely Ellen Tracy coat. It's a size 12, and it's a swing coat. I should have left it buttoned up but anyway I'll have a picture and you'll be able to see see it better but the details here you have the big block sleeves I'll try it on for you guys it's a size 12 and swing coats are made to fit a little big but you can see already I love collars that stand up like that. It's so much drama. That's the only kind of drama I need in my life. Yes, ma'am. But this is really, really cute. I'm going to stand up here so you can see that. Now, this is a little too big for me. So it's going to go in my store, um, Southern Soul Thrifting. I'll have the link down there for you. Again, like I said before, never ever sleep on plus size clothing if you are a reseller. 
if it's in good condition and it's on trend, it will sell. Just like that mustard colored top that I have. That was a 2X, I believe. So, plus size sisters need love too. And here I have Ann Taylor. I love, love, love Ann Taylor. Very classic, but just a little sweater here. This is a button down. And I would keep it, but it does not fit. That'd be good for the office or when you wanna have a little something on over your camisole at church. Gotta work. Now, my next find here, I have to give myself a little pat on the back. It is a TB or Tibby. I don't know how you pronounce it. It's T I B I. I just know that we had uh, or maybe still have a store over on St. Simon's Island. And the stuff is very expensive. This one I got for five dollars. Five dollars is very wrinkled, excuse that please. But it's this nice, beautiful coral color that I am addicted to. Unfortunately, it is not my size. You can see that nice detail there in the back. And this shirt is what it size is this? It's an extra small, but it fits big, it's supposed to. Okay, and the cost, are you ready for this guys? $325 is what it retails for, and it was marked down, I guess that's $163. I guess that would be a, a deal if you had that kind of money to spend, but I didn't. See there the price yes no maybe so love it I think that will sell very well on eBay and what I have next is an Ann Taylor loft blouse which is very cute it has the gathered sleeves right at the end, and it is a button down. I think this is very feminine. It's flowy. It has this nice print on it, and extra small. Now this um, fit on my plus size mannequin here, so this is designed to be very flowy and billowy because this is. It looks bigger than an extra small, if you ask me. I think maybe I could fit it. Uh, nah, it'll be in the store. Now I have two men's pieces here. This is a slow bucks sweatshirt. Uh, what drew my attention to it is the big graphic on the front. It reminds me of comic strips. <clears throat> and I took a look at the tag. And I said, hmm, that looks like it is different. And I looked it up on eBay. Obviously, Slow Bucks uh, is the combination of two guys' names. And they used to make shirts for themselves. And they were very popular with their friends. So they decided to make their own line. And uh, they're like a hip hop brand. And so we'll put it on eBay. I didn't really see any comps for these. So I'm not sure what I can get for that one. That's a size medium it's men's, if I didn't say that before. And last but not least, we have this Quicksilver t shirt. You know, nothing to write home about. It's just a regular t-shirt. What I loved on it was the little saying. I'll show it to you first. But it says, 
Don't be afraid to wear your clothes hard. You can always get more. That's true. <laughs> so this will be uh, up on the store as well. Okay, guys. Well, that is all that I have for you. What I'm going to do now is tell you how much I spent. And I did forget to, to um, do my averages. But I think I may be able to remember. So, let's see here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. That was ten pieces. The total was $30.59. So, that averages out to be about $3 a piece. Which is not bad. There you have it, Salvation Army Thrift Haul. I need you to hit that like button, to subscribe, and to come back for more. As always, thank you.